In today's video, we're going to explain what supercritical CO2 extraction is and how it's used to produce a full spectrum oil. We're going to cover how it's used for extraction of terpenes, a subcritical run, and a supercritical run. We're going to do all of this in under three minutes, and the footage I'm going to use today is complements of Apex Supercritical under the Prosperin brand. Let's have a look. So here you can see a supercritical system, a rather large one, and I'm going to just explain a few components of this for your benefit. Essentially, you have a CO2 tank, which is generating that gas we talked about, that runs over the biomass that you load in these extractor vessels, and that will eventually go into a separator vessel where they will pull out solution and you'll be able to harness the oil. So let's have a look what it actually looks like. So here we have milled biomass, and the reason we mill it is to get a lot of even consistency. And that cannabis will be loaded into the system. The supercritical or subcritical CO2 will run over it. And in that process, it will extract oils. Now, as it moves from the extractor vessel into the separator vessel that we see next, essentially the change in its pressures allow that oil to precipitate out and the CO2 gas evaporates off, making it a very clean solvent for extraction. And from here, you'll basically harvest and extract your oil. And that's a supercritical system. So how do we use a system like a supercritical to produce a full spectrum oil? Well, you run it in different stages. The first run of about 20 minutes, you strip the terpenes, which are those beautiful aromatic compounds. Then what you would do is you would increase the pressure within these systems to get what's called a subcritical fraction, which just has more of the cannabinoids in there, as well as some of the flavonoids. And then you'd ultimately go to what's called a supercritical stage, where you run the system to its maximum. And this gives you your final fraction that has most of the cannabinoids. Now, with that final fraction of most of the cannabinoids, we try to remove a lot of the waxes and uh, unwanted. So what we'll do is we'll add some ethanol, we'll freeze that overnight, and we'll filter out those waxes in a flask, and that can be used for cosmetics, and we'll ultimately place it in a rotovap so that we can strip the oil and the ethanol. Now at the end, to create full spectrum oil, we'll mix the supercritical and the subcritical fraction with the beautiful terpenes to ultimately produce what is more comprehensive and a full spectrum oil using the different fractions. Now that is essentially a summary of how to produce full spectrum oil using supercritical extraction. I'm going to be covering more of these type of extraction technologies as well as testing technologies on the channel, so be sure to look out for additional content.